we need to focus off on shared prosperity. Going forward, this thing has been attempted many times. There has been attempts to reconcile this nation into the future, but it has always been short-lived. We want President William Ruto and Leila Odinga to be remembered as the two gentlemen who instituted long-term national reconciliation platform in this republic by making sure that we have created an accord which brings out shared prosperity because that is our problem. People feeling excluded is our main problem. And there's no way you can, uh, you can silence them uh, using guns. The way I hear some of the readers saying, Atitutawasanya on Monday, we are going to crush them. You crush who? You can crush one, but you can't crush all of us. So the way to go is to make sure that what the president has put together is expanded into a national prosperity platform. We need to dig down even into BBI and ask, what good was in BBI? Who was not properly involved when we were crafting the BBI document? What else can we bring on board to create shared prosperity? And that is what we are looking upon. The other thing is that uh, whatever is being put together must be inclusive. We must use the principle of inclusivity. We don't want two people or three people to sit together and say, this is the direction which Kenya should take. No. MPs, yes, is the initial process, but we must involve everybody. It must be multi-sectoral. We want to see the faith sector involved. We want to see even African eminent persons involved. We want to see electoral technology specialists involved so that we can ask ourselves what went wrong and what should we do to, to, to mitigate the same from recurring in the next general election. We want to see the civil societies involved and engaged, non-governmental organizations, political parties, all leaders, so that whatever we put together has an input of every other segment and sector within and without Kenya. That's the only way we are going to come up with a document, an accord which is sustainable into the future.